Why isn't Josie going with you to the party? It's not going to work out. <clears throat> no, it's wrong. Amanda, uh, maybe Matt doesn't want to discuss it? There's got to be a reason. There is a reason. I uh, have a swim team practice, and I won't be getting to the party until very late. Matt. Uh, Matthew, would you like a soda or something? Sure. Uh, Sam, I promised Vicky that she could borrow this purse. Would you mind taking it over to her, please? Amanda, it's none of our business. It's my brother, Sam. He's also my nephew, Amanda. Sam. Actually, I better get to that practice. No, I... don't go, please. Why? Look, I know something is wrong between you and Josie. Is there somebody else? <sighs> Things haven't been the same since New Year's. Why? What happened on New Year's? This is hard to talk about, man. Did you, um, did things change? Did we sleep together? No. Well, then why are things different? <sighs> because things, uh, things between guys and girls, it, it, it's stupid. I you mean, about sex? Well, guys, are supposed to try and try and try and girls are supposed to say no. That, that's how it goes, right? Well, not all girls say no. And uh, sometimes guys say no. And Josie? I'm not sure how she was feeling at the time, actually. Really, Matt, so far all of this sounds perfectly normal. <laughs> Oh, there's more. What? <sighs> there's somebody else. There is? Josie saw me kissing her the other day. Oh, poor Josie. Look, that's okay. I mean, that's normal, too. You're not some kind of monster or something because you're attracted to somebody else. It's Lisa. Lisa Grady? You were kissing Lisa Grady? It, it was one night last week. I, a burglar came into her apartment, and I, she was scared. I, I came in, I got rid of the guy, and, well, she was scared. I, when I'm scared, I don't end up kissing a boy that's half my age. I'm not half her age. So you came to her rescue. She was crying. And you kissed it and made it all better. Don't make fun of me, Amanda. I don't believe this. What do you don't believe? She's intelligent. She's beautiful. She's a nice person. She was engaged to your brother. So? So it's not right. Oh, you want me to talk to you while you're being so judgmental? Matthew! Lisa Grady, of all people! I like her. You like her? I like her, and I said that. Has she been after you? No. Oh. I'm not going to even dignify that with an answer. <laughs> I mean, she has. No, she hasn't. She hasn't been after anybody. She's got too much going for her to do that. Oh, right. She's a terrific person, Amanda. And she's all wrong for you. How do you know what's right and wrong for me? I know she is. And I know how I feel. <sighs> Are you in love with her? <sighs> Doesn't matter. What do you mean it doesn't matter? It doesn't matter. She's leaving tonight. Leaving? <sighs> Europe. Vacation? Job. London. She's... She told me yesterday she doesn't know when she's coming back. <sighs> she's leaving Bay City? Can you blame her? No. And actually, I think it's going to be the best thing for all of us. Well, that was quick. Yeah. Uh, look, Jamie wants us across the hall. He wants to play with his new camera some more. He must have 20 hours of just you, me, and Allie. Who does he think he is, Andy Warhol? Well, let's humor the guy, OK? OK. OK. Matt, you want to come, too? Oh, no, no. I, I think I'll 
Stay here and finish my drink. <laughs> Feel free, Matt. Thanks. Come on, Amanda. said goodbye over the phone. Um, I was wondering if I could come over. I don't think that'd be it such a good... It would only take a minute. Matt, Lisa. you should be with Josie. Lisa, I just want to talk to you for a minute. Matt, we said goodbye. Let's just leave it at that. Richard, this doesn't feel right. Oh, you're going to be great. No, no, no. I mean being in a men's locker room. Relax. I got the whole area sectioned off for the presentation. Well, I'm a real downer tonight, aren't I? Nah. Yes, yes, I am. And I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just in a lousy mood. Yeah, I understand. It'll be cool between you and... Uh, what's his name? Matthew. Trust me. It's not just Matthew, anyway. I'm... I'm just having a hard time dealing with everything that's going on at the farm. Uh, you mean with the marshal coming down there? I mean, how would you like it if strangers came into your house and started taking your things away? Uh, I wouldn't. My mom and my uncle are, are fighting. It's just like everything bad's happening all at once. <laughs> Mark, what's up? Hey, what's going, Richard? Mark Royer, lucky to meet Miss Sunshine, Josie Watts. Hello. I told Richard I wasn't going to take this award unless I met Miss Sunshine. You did. Sure did. Well, I mean, you won't accept the award, right? It's uh, a big deal. It's a piece of junk that sits on my dresser collecting dust. But the chance to meet a girl who looks like you, that's a big deal. have to say can interest me. Please, I'm trying to help you. Charlene, if you don't listen to me, you could end up being charged with a very serious crime. <laughs> 